and see if this pen really is as cool as what it's advertised as. Hey guys, welcome to the video, Brandon here. And today I have a cool little uh, idea in mind I've been thinking about, and so I finally was able to pick one up. When you think about writing with an ink pen, um, you have to keep it point down while you're writing on the paper. So if you're like laying on your back, maybe you're, you know, upside down, the ink will eventually stop, and the pen doesn't work, it just starts scratching the paper or whatever surface you're writing on. Basically that's gravity. And if you also think about astronauts in space, how do they write because they don't have gravity, so their ink pens wouldn't work and they had to resort to pencil. Well, so this guy, Paul Fisher, came up with the idea of this space pen that he invented. I don't know that he actually invented it, but he's one that got, has credit for it on the name of the pen. Uh, so what he has here, and I'll just kind of show you, it's called the Fisher Space Pen. This is the bullet model. Um, and we just kind of look here, right underwater, upside down at any angle, over grease, uh, even in extreme temperatures, negative 30 to positive 250 degrees Fahrenheit, and then Fisher Space Pen. So this pen is pretty incredible. Um, and here's a pool. So I thought, hey, let's try it out and see, maybe we can do some writing underwater. I got a couple different textures, some paper, uh, some material, some rubber, like we can do some different textures and see if this pen really is as cool as what it's advertised as. Inside of the ink, you have a float that separates the pressurized gas. So what it has basically, it has a pressurized gas canister in the back of it that is holding a constant pressure on the ink. Uh, and then over here, yeah, again, you see the 30 to 250 degree operating range, zero gravity, any angle upside down. Uh, so it's the pen of choice for ski patrols, search and rescue, law enforcement, pretty much everything that's out there. Um, and then here's the fella here, Paul C. Fisher, Fisher Space Pen. Let's check it out and see what the pen looks like. All right, so here's the pen. Pen. You can see here, it pulls out and then it flips around and then that's your, your pen. So actually it's pretty compact. I mean, you can see a three by five index card significantly shorter. And let's compare height wise. Without the cap, it is not much taller than the height of the card. And it works just fine. So if we look a little bit closer at the pen, it's just kind of a polished chrome you can read right there, Fisher Space Pen. And then you've got the little seal here. So this is actually the, the cartridge with the ink. We can unthread here. And then there is your ink with the gas canister. I believe it's like a pressurized nitrogen or something that's in there. Um, and they actually have writing on here. Uh, if you need a refill, you can just send in $6 to this address and they can get you a, a refill. And then if you notice here, right here, also you've got a little rubber gasket that just keeps that all sealed and airtight. So that's pretty cool. Pop that shut and let's go try it underwater.
Did I video you? Okay, first, uh, get down here where I can see. First run is index card. We're gonna see how this works underwater. Let me roll them. Okay, sweet. All right, here we go. Underwater index card. Here we go. That's crazy. It works. It works really well. <laughs> The bottom was a little bit textured, you can see, so the pebble texture on the bottom of the pool uh, was a little bit hard, but it wrote just fine, and now it's starting to smear. That's so cool. It writes really well. <laughs> okay, next we're going to try um, a, some different textures. So I've got uh, my shorts, I'm gonna see if I can actually write on like the material, see if we can do that. Down a little bit, there you go. That writes so well. That's amazing. This thing is awesome. Okay, last thing we're gonna try to see if, if the rubber of my goggles, if I can actually do that. So let's do that. Come down here. Okay. Down. Look at that. <laughs> that, that is incredible. That's crazy. <laughs> well. Pin one, water zero. It does it. A little smeary, but not. Well, it's because it's not a, it's not a, it's not a, a absorbent yeah. surface to hold the ink. That's but crazy. the pin just writes no, no problem. Wow, that is awesome. This is my assistant, Blake. All right, guys. Well, that was all for the video. I just wanted to do this one little underwater space pin. Thanks for watching. Love your family. Love your friends. Love living life. <laughs>